<laughs> Let's go. My name's Danky, so welcome to the next episode of Star Citizen. We last left off, we picked up two hot cargoes. I believe we have some meth, and I believe we've got a delivery we've got to drop off at, at Shubin. And uh, because Shubin's in the dark, we are not going there. I, re I refuse to go to Shubin in the dark anymore, and we I would like to see it in all its glory. So, we're going to ride around here with, with two missions in our back pocket. Let's go ahead and see what else is available here. We've accepted some... Cargo recovery, that's good. We just got to deliver it. Go fish. Acquire the shipment from the wreckage. Um, let's go ahead and... Let's track go fish here. Let's untrack this one. So we're going to go... The caterpillar blew up with something valuable on board. So let's go to this one. Don't tell me that's 8 million miles away. The goods. Hey. Something called the goods, I, I'm interested in it. <laughs> but I think we're going back to Delamar here. Mm. If I could find it. So let's, let's zoom out here. I, I seem to be a little befuddled here. Alright, so we've located the goods. There are said goods. Let's go ahead and we're going to go to Delamar and pick up the goods. Could be a little egregious, could be a little dangerous. Initiated. Both of which we have a high level of interest in. So we, we've got a couple missions in our back pocket we're trying to knock out. I don't know what, what the goods are going to be. Could it be weaponry? Could it be unmarketable securities? Maybe a load of fresh gold pressed Yeezys for delivered to everyone in WHP. If that's the case, I'm all in. But also that would mean that it, a friendly caterpillar got destroyed mid-range jumper. And now we've got to pick up the pieces. <laughs> Alright, we just zoomed the goods. I'm a fan that the goods are not on a surface crash. Quantum travel. Let's go hard left here. That's still a, an incredulous distance away. So let's go zoom in here quite a little bit. Uh-oh. What happened to the goods? The goods disappeared on us. Looks like someone may have finished it before us. Good for them. Bad for us. Well, I think I just learned a valuable lesson. There are timers on these missions. So that's probably most likely why it disappeared. I'm, I'm a little surprised that the mission timer is, I think it was maybe 30 minutes. So let's, let's actually double back here to Shubs and see if we can get there in time. Um, so we got to go back to Daymar here. So maybe we got a little greedy. I wonder what happens to the, uh, to the cargo that we did collect. Is that vaporize? Uh-oh. We're obstruct, obstruction of justice here. There we go. All right, we'll go back here. Bottom travel. Spool Initiate. it up. So we're going to go head to Shubes ASAP. Well, Dan, you said you weren't going to go because I'm the dark side of the moon. Well, we've got a decision to make. We're not going to go dark side and, and let, burn a mission and credits? I don't think so. We're going to the dark side. All right, so Shubin's about 120 away, but we're getting pulled down into the ether. So I'm going to quickly get uncoupled here we should be fine should being the key word we're, we're, we're approaching a shoving it at a, a measly 260 mph well it's not mph it's meters per second but you get what I'm after so if we can top end this thing so about still got a ways to go here you guys always know my concern is just why we're being pulled down to the surface. I mean, this could be... We haven't bounced in a long time. And I, I'm not... In the, hopefully not in the business of, of bouncing our ship off the turf here. But it seemed like that could... I don't want to call it inevitable, because that's not the, the right terminology. But... <laughs> it's certain with our current altitude... Right at about 1500. 
Let's try to even her out, pull up a little bit. There we go. Okay, we've stabled it off. We'll be back here in Chubbs. This was too nice of a shot to pass up here. You got the, the Luke Skywalker double moon rising in the right. The golden WHP flagship soaring. Look at it, just, if we get the Shubin and the sun shines upon us, what will stop us? The answer, nothing. That's pretty, I've never seen a sunrise in the game before. They do exist, and they are beautiful. As we approach an illicit Shubin mining facility, anyone at Shubin, Alright, the sun rises and sets on a new dawn of Star Citizen. That cut the engines. Should be a nice coastal right in here. Anyone at Shubbin? <laughs> I don't believe we need clearance to land here. Dan, you, you say that every time you go to Shubs? Well, if I stand corrected, it's better to stand than not stand at all. Look at that. One can only hope. I, I do have this, this aggression with the game. You should be able to jump somewhere near these points of interest on these planets. Like, it, it, it took, I mean, through the magic of YouTube, you didn't have to get the, those five minutes, but it was literally just five minutes of decoupling. Set her down. Screw. Almost fully set. What are we going to do in the meantime to offset? <laughs> Let's go ahead and open the canopy. <laughs> and then exit here. Wait a second. We're going to have to get the goods out of the back pocket. I believe so. I'm also wondering if our mission also stalled out. Look at those golden arms. Let's uh, let's take a look and see if that mission is still active. Otherwise, could have taken way too much time for the delivery. No, we're good. Deliver the crate to the Shubin outpost on Daymart. Dan is pronounced Shubin. I agree. So let's go ahead. Question is, which one do we take? Couches, couches, which one do I pick? Well, we've got two to choose from. We have a memory of a young squirrel, so let's see what the mission is going to tell us. Mm. Cargo recovery. Which one was the busted one? The busted one was the blue one. Answer. Ah, uh, that's not the one we wanted. Pick up the blue one. Let's go. All right, so it says to take it to the Shubbin facility. So I'm guessing that's the one. There's no flag on it though, so I'd rather let's take it to the flag one and see what it says. And a bright early morning at Shubin, what could go wrong? We've got our footsteps rolling for us. Yeezy looking very shined up and fresh. We've got a, a cargo mission to complete. Let's see if they will accept the goods. It's, it's not looking like they will, but you never know. I think people say you got to talk to the individual working the gates. Excuse me, sir. Would you like uh, your cargo? Sir? Uh... Sir, here, I'll just put it right here for you. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> we'll put it right there for you, buddy. We'll leave the light on for you. That's for you. Now, can we chat it up? Well... Normally there's like a spot that you slide into the DMs here, but uh, we'll just, we'll count that 
That is a mission completed in our book. Let's see if they're... Excuse me? Did you see this? Are those gold bars up there? I don't know what those things are. Um, Let's go ahead and see what else is available for our, our present day purchasing since we didn't get credits on that. Delivery needed it or find someone else. <laughs> Here's what we're going to try and do. We're going to try something a little different here. Let's head over the, the vehicle spawner. I'm gonna I'm gonna just just test something here. Dan, should I be concerned? Maybe. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna spawn a ship that we can eject from. Step one. Oh, we we can't spawn ships here, can we? We can only spawn land speeders. Well, you can't self-destruct a land speeder, can you? I don't believe so. Let's see. Just I'm 99% sure we can't spawn ships here. Which is a little... I mean, I guess it makes sense because where are they going to get a ship from, right? But at the same time, where are they going to get ground vehicles from? Let's, uh... Let's take out the dragonfly. Maybe. Here's what we'll do. We'll slide it in. You think a dragonfly will f fit into the renegade? I believe it will. We'll try sliding it in. Alright, so we are on said dragonfly. Let's power her up. Hello and welcome aboard your Drake interplanetary craft. Your mm. systems are online. Engines on. Engines online. Landing gear up. Launch complete. System online. All right, nice and easy here. That's that's got a nice look to it. The gold on the black land speeder. Now here's where we make our monies. It has to fit. Excuse me. You think we're giving up that easy? One slight pass? It didn't work like that. Is it just... Are we too... Uh, are we too t tall for it? Get in there. <laughs> Alright. Well, that lesson was learned. What? Let's take her sky high here, boys. See, we got a plan number two. Raise this thing up like Josh Groban. How high? Can we get this thing up in the air? Like, I'm talking like mega air. I think we got we to gotta hit, hit a hill here. Then get some straight up air, straight up, straight up. Let's launch yourselves. I don't know how we've done that in the past. Yeah, that's what we want. Up in the sky, boys. All right, so now this is what we're trying to do. Hang on, don't bring us down to this. Oh, someone coming in. There's a ship coming in, boys. Let's go! Target, please. Oh, yeah! Just when you thought it wasn't safe. Let's go! We're trying to... 
We're trying to land in there. <laughs> oh. Hang tight. All of a sudden, we got, we got, we got some good stuff. Oh. That's a good thing this thing's durable. Good thing it's durable, boys. Cut the engines. Let's see what he's up to. <laughs> Let's go. Unmarketable securities. What is this guy doing? Think he's keeping an eye on us? <laughs> Raise up here a little. One thing we don't want to do is we just don't want to crash. What's he doing up there? Slow. Okay. He's okay. No. 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 So let's give him. A, let's give him a, a landing rating here. That was a seven out of ten. Cut the engines, please. Uh oh. We got launched. Dan, what are you going to do? Let's just see where, if he's getting out the side piece or going out the back. <laughs> Hello. Welcome. Hop on. What's he doing? That's like the act of someone who may, may be guilty. Let's just turn up a little dust storm on him for a second. Listen to that new music. Now we've got something, a little something, something to explore here. Got a few options. One, see if he unlocked it. Two, if he didn't unlock it, can we please be a stowaway? He locked it. This door should have to be unlocked. What was that noise? It's all locked up. Did he, he didn't respond. So, we got a few options here. Let's just let's just get in our ship here. Mind your own beeswax. Yeah, Dan, do we actually believe you're gonna mind your own beeswax? Let's just see what let's see how this thing unfolds here. Alright, so we've, we've had a little bit of issue here, just getting some stabilization here. Tr trying to get it stable here before this guy gets out. It's being stable, the, the lead condition. Engines should be on. It's not happening for us. I guess th this Avenger's he's got some serious bug issues, but let's see if we can pull this thing out. It's not looking like it. There we go. Come on, give us give us a little power here. Give us a little power. Engines off. Engines, Engines on. Offline. Engines online. Come on. Give us a little power here, boys. Low power. Alright, power the whole thing down. 
Bring it back online. Sometimes you got it's it's like that old your old trusty 1997 Ford Escort. Lime green color. You got to start her up a few times. There you go. Come on. You got to start her up a few times. There we go. All right, let's go. Now, stable this thing out. He's done it. Cut the engines for a second. Just like your old lime green. Let's see if we can get this thing back here. He's done it. All right, good. So we're just going to chill here for a second. Let's see what happens. All right, we missed it, but he, apparently he slid into his ship because uh, we saw the, the, uh, the old blue. Yep, there he goes. And here we go. He does our technique. That's our technique. Oh, he's out of here. He's leaving dust trails. He's leaving dust trails. What the heck just happened? doing here we... Jabob full speed ahead boys Dan are you doing some real life jousting I'm not doing that it's not happening we're just we're just lining things up here Giving you guys some cinematics. Oh. Hey, Jabob, is he gonna take off? He needs to answer our call to duty here. Less than 3,000 meters away. Oh, he's gassing now. Missiles die. Whoa. About to find this thing out. Landing gear to go Is he can he outrun it? Damn that that was a did he, I think he outran it. How did he get out? He, he got out pretty fast or something's not right. Landing gear retract. And he's gone. Maybe Maybe for the betterment of society. We gave it the good old college try for a little interaction. It's quiet right now in Star Wars Citizen. Go to dampeasting.tv slash discord. We'll try to organize something. We've been trying to stir up the hornet's nest, but the hornets aren't coming out. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you guys did, click the like button. up, would a great deal. If you'd love to share with your friend, neighbor, enemy. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.